Welcome to another video blog. Today we're going to be talking about to-do lists and productivity. We're going to be looking at the Eisenhower productivity quadrants. These are where you divide your page up into four equal quadrants. For the first quadrant, we're going to be looking at things that are urgent and important. Then we're going to look at things that are urgent but not important. Then things that are not important and not urgent. And then finally, not urgent, but very important. It's really clever to put some examples down of what you might use these quadrants for. Obviously, important and urgent would mean that there's time constraints and that it's pretty important. Something like taxes, for example. If you want to do the last quadrant, you would look at something along the lines of journaling. It's not important and it's not urgent, but it is something that you enjoy doing. So the nice to haves are usually in the last quadrant. To make sure that I can reuse my quadrants regularly, what I do is I write down all my tasks on little post-it flags. I can then move them around as needed, depending on if they're urgent or important, etc. I try to keep them as easy as possible and simple in the wording that I use to make sure that I know exactly what's going on in those tasks. Usually the tasks that are up in the top right hand quadrant, urgent and important, are usually the tasks that need to get done first. Now that we have all our tasks mapped out, I'm going to create nine boxes. The first box is going to be for very important things. Then the next three boxes are going to be for medium sized things that I need to get done in my day. And then again, the last boxes, which are five, those are the smaller things that I need to get done during the space of my day. I call them daily priorities. And what I love about this part is I can easily move around the flags as needed. Great, now that I've got all my tasks in place, I can put them in priority order on my daily priorities. I now know which tasks I need to get done first and which ones I can leave for later. Thanks for sharing this amazing productivity tip with me today. I'm looking forward to seeing how you use it. Please feel free to follow us on Instagram, Facebook, and on Pinterest. And obviously, please hit the subscribe button below. See you next time.